100 Rise of an Empire hits movie theater today. And while I got to chat with the cast, even our viewers got to chime in and sneak in a question or two. Take a look. New in theaters this week, I took a trip to L.A. to talk with the actors of 300 Rise of an Empire, the sequel to Zack Snyder's 2007 blockbuster. And what I found was an action-packed film ruled by strong female characters, such as a manipulating and vengeful commander of the Persian army. I'm not here as a witness. Your character is so badass, girl power. Tell us about the research behind your character. I mean, it, you know, is my character is very loosely inspired from the, the real Artemisia. So I kind of, you know, drew my inspiration from more like um, characters like Lady Macbeth or Cleopatra, those very strong, you know, uh, women. Uh, but I think the training that I had to, to do kind of helped me to build uh, my armor, she's like a wild animal, uh, you know, completely obsessed uh, by vengeance and she, she, she wants to, yeah, she's like a samurai and like a kind of a crazy Joan of Arc or something. How do you guys train for, for this sort of movie? Uh, we just we had Mark Twight who was yeah, did a lot lift, of these, didn't lifting you? stuff. Yeah. That was your favourite one with two yeah. dumbbells. I've seen yeah. Helen do that a lot, sometimes on set. Yeah. And I copied him. Mark, 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 for me, it was just a case of copying people. That's all you did? Well, yeah, it's just always That's how I've was. gotten this far in my career, actually, so it's funny you say that. That's There's a lot to be said, isn't there, for imitation? Yeah, 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 imitation. There's an art form to it. There is, there is. I'm making a career out of it, too. <laughs> we already have that in common? Are you hitting on me? Oh, my God. Okay, <laughs> I'm just, I'm just no imi problem. I'm actually imitating you, right? Oh, okay. Well, then you have to kind of... Okay, there you go. <laughs> you guys have some crazy scenes. You're cutting heads off. You're just... Stabbing the hell out of people. Is there a point like behind the scenes where you're like you're laughing, you're like, oh my, this is crazy. Yeah, because ex you know, you're doing all this stuff, and, and externally you're kind of staunch and like, yeah, just do this every day. But inside you're like Phoebe from Friends, losing it, just going, oh my god, this is awesome. You know? Look at you. But I do have the shoulder. Oh my I'm, god. The movie, the costumes inspired me. <laughs> have I not given enough for your dream of a united Greece, Themistocles? A king, a husband. Avenge him. I love that you are kicking ass. Like the women are, they're kicking ass on the, on this movie. Yeah, there's some tough, tough chicks. But you're movie. reluctant at some point to go and like go to war and just tear up the enemy. Why? Why is your uh, character reluctant? Uh, well, she's a Spartan and sort of they stand alone. You know, Sparta is is their um, treasure and and they don't want to join with any. They're kind of old school in that mm -hmm. way, I guess, the Spartans. Right. She's like, I don't want to risk anything else for you. Right, who are for you? For us, who are you? What are you doing in your leather skirt? Right? Go Pro on. Prove yourself. Go Wear some leather underpants and then we'll exactly, talk. Exactly, exactly. You know, so she's she's kind of steadfast in, in her belief and her uh, loyalty to Sparta. Okay, tell us about the costumes. You were talking about the leather and all of that. Mm. Um, anything you kept, you took home? Because some, <laughs> some viewers <laughs> want to know. It's like, did they take anything home for <laughs> other activities? <laughs> Yes, our viewers are freaky like that. What's mm -hmm. up, viewers? Mm -hmm. Yes, I kept a pair of leather underpants for a driving hat. No, I didn't. <laughs> uh, I believe David Wenham stole his underwear because eight years later he could still get into them. So he oh, was very wow, happy. Oh, wow, okay. How do you work among so many hot men, like so many hotties? I didn't even notice. You didn't? You wouldn't even look so sad, like, hey, ooh, 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 sweaty here, sweaty there, I like you. <laughs> you know what? For a minute, it's sort of impressive, you know, because. But I literally was like, I really need to go to the gym in my real life. Because <laughs> uh, it's ridiculous. But then after a while, I start thinking, oh, I'd like to put some clothes on them because it would be more interesting. 